relaxation. Some of you might be like, what is that? I have heard of that phrase before. Not very familiar with it. another minivan moment all right you guys this is this is relaxed this is chill right now I am so relaxed and I haven't felt this way in a while I feel really good all right so we're gonna talk about finding time sketching out time for taking care of you and relaxation I went and got a massage today. Oh my goodness, it felt so good. My good friend Cherie, I love going to her home. She works out of her home and she gives massages. She's amazing and wow, she has like the strongest hands of any human being I know. And so I went today and visited with her and got a good rub down. You gotta take care of you, you know what I'm saying? Have you guys ever gotten a massage? If you haven't, it could feel awkward at times a little revealing uh yeah. yeah i mean you're in a vulnerable position could be kind of scary you're laying there in the headrest and sometimes I, i'm not sure what how i should have my head in that little hole and you're looking down you're like is this am i too far this way you know oh my gosh and i can only imagine what i must look like from in that hole hmm. It's good that you, when you're face down and they're really working you, if you are in pain, I do get pain um, because of working on the computer. Because sometimes editing and uploading can take over two hours, two hours or more. I mean, so I could be hunched over, and this is every day, and hunched over, and the way that I hunch, I, I'm in pain. I have this one knot up right here in my shoulder, and it's pretty bad. Like, I don't notice it until she, like, massages me, and when she touches me there, like, the slightest touch, it's like a zinger. It sends me through the roof. So when she gets in there and works that, it can be pretty painful. And thank goodness my face is looking down into this hole, because I can only imagine what I must look like when she's massaging me. She did this new thing on me today that she's never done. She's done like that karate chop all over my body. That was hilarious. Oh, that makes everything jiggle. I'm sure it's good for the body, but not the self-esteem. Cherie is such a doll. She's amazing. So thank you, Cherie, for awesome massages. Oh my goodness. So I go once a month. Um, I used to not go once a month. I really would like go once every six months and then it was like once a year And I have noticed since I have been going once a month my anxiety is down my stress level is down I still get stressed, but it's so much more manageable So the point of this minivan moment is to find time in your schedule where you can mark time for you um, if it's taking a hot bath if it's going and getting your nails done, if it's going and getting the massage, or going and getting some hot chocolate and just relaxing, go to the city library uh, and just sit there with the books and read and just sink into the nice soft chairs that they have. But I, it's so important as women that we find time for us and that we can unwind. Sometimes you can get away for an hour and sometimes it's only for 20 minutes. But if you could find time just for you, it'll make you feel so good and let that stress go. So I definitely encourage finding time for you for relaxation. So let's make it a goal this month. Find time for you. Let's find time for us. Where can I sketch out time for me and just chill? So I did today and it was wonderful. I feel so good. I feel so good and relaxed. And I gotta drink my water because all the toxins that get released from massages. So I'm gonna be in the bathroom quite a bit today. Mmm, water. Mmm. What are you gonna do today? I want you to find some time in the next couple of days where you can relax, put on some music, chill. And here's the thing kick guilt out the window. No guilt. 
find time. Netflix, go binge Netflix for a day. I've done that, it's glorious. Curl up in a blanket. If you work and you can't find a day, maybe a day on the weekend, but find some time for you. You wanna know something else I do? I will shower at night and I will turn off the lights, light some candles, or I'll put my cell phone flashlight on to flash it up on the ceiling. And I will shower where it's dark with a little bit of light and just let that hot water pour on me because I don't have a bathtub. So I don't take baths. If you guys have a bath, oh, go take a bubble bath, turn off the lights, put on some candles and just soak away. I love it. It feels so good. And I will stay in that shower until the water goes cold. Yeah, that's my minivan moment. Find time for you. And when you do, let me know. Tell me in the comments, what do you like to do to relax? Because sometimes, some of us at times don't know what to do to relax. It could be very stressful and you're like, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what to do to relax. I get that way a lot. So down below, everyone leave their tips. What do you do that helps you relax? And we can like bounce them off of each other and find ways to just chill. I'm feeling good today. I feel good. Bring it, bring on today. <laughs> I can handle it today with my massage. I can handle it. So I'm hoping today's a good day. It will be a good day. I'm not hoping it's gonna be a good day. I got a massage, I'm chill, I'm chill. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for joining me on this minivan moment. Don't forget to click on my face up above to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, hit the bell so you get notified when I upload. So check out the two videos that I have over here for you, and especially the minivan moment playlist. All right, thanks for joining me today, guys. We'll see you later. Bye.